Hi friends, this is Deepika. Welcome to Sewing is Fun. So today in this video, I am going to show you few ideas for how you can uh, reuse your old printed sarees. So let's quickly get started. So the first idea is to make a plain kurti uh, bodies with a printed sleeves and along with that you can also add uh, the printed strips in your uh, sides and bottom of your kurti. Uh, making a yoke pattern with the printed kurti is also a very nice idea but uh, here you can also um, add the printed fabric in your uh, neck design till the waistline and uh, decorate it with a multicolor lace like this. You can combine different parts uh, from your sari like uh, from the pallu from the uh, middle of your pattern if you have different uh, prints in uh, a particular uh, sari you can just combine them and uh, create this kind of yoke pattern to decorate your plain or printed kurti. If you are left with this kind of check printed cotton sari, then uh, making a peplum style uh, top is a very good idea. You can wear this with a um, trouser or jeans and uh, here they had given a yoke pattern. So uh, you can also add uh, a pallu to make this uh, kind of yoke pattern. You can use that pallu fabric and make this yoke pattern and the rest of the sari you can use to make this top. To make a daily wear kurti, you can uh, use a plain fabric to make the bodies of your kurti and uh, uh, to make the neckline, you can use the printed fabric of your sari uh, like a pallu and uh, here they had given an overlapping yoke pattern and along with that they had given a contrast color uh, piping also in the edges of this uh, neckline. To decorate it further they had added a few fabric buttons which is of contrast color so you can also do that. You can also decorate your 3 4 sleeve with the same uh, pallu's fabric uh, just make the strip and attach it in the end of your sleeves. If you are having a block printed sari, then you can make this kind of jacket. This is really looking very beautiful and you can combine it with any uh, plain cotton top and wear it with a jeans. They had given a beautiful contrast color pipings also and added a uh, contrast color strips in the sleeves end. So this is again a very beautiful pattern you can try for uh, some Indo Western look. If you have a double colored sari or a half of sari, then you can use the single uh, sari to create this outfit. Here you need to use both the two colors which you have in your sari uh, to make the inner top and the uh, jacket pattern. Also to match it further, they had used uh, the strips to decorate the jacket and the fabric which is being used in the jacket strip is uh, the same fabric which is used in the inner top. Make sure to wear a plain plazo pant with this printed top and jacket pattern. Printed cotton sarees are very light and the fabric is also very comfortable and soft. So you can make this kind of night suits from your uh, printed sarees. Just attach the astas and also to decorate you can use a pipings or fabric buttons. You can make beautiful yoke patterns from uh, for the necklines. You can also try mix and match combinations like using a different sari for making the top part and a different sari to make the pajama or the bottom part. With your bandage print sari, you can make this type of a straight kurti and uh, you can decorate that with a pallu's fabric by making uh, the strip from that fabric and uh, uh, add it in the back part of your kurti and in the sleeves end. You can create a half half kurti or a, a panel kurti from your uh, different sarees uh, patterns. If you have a, a two different color sarees with you then you can mix and match that with a single strip in the uh, middle of your kurti and uh, just attach that same uh, prints in the sleeves end also. You can decorate that kurti with uh, buttons uh, and make a front button kurti too. 
if you don't want to make any more efforts to decorate your kurti then simply you can purchase a crochet lace uh, which is of contrast color and uh, you can uh, make a simple printed kurti a straight one and decorate the neckline with a contrast color crochet lace and few buttons that will also work well for your daily wear look adding a square or rectangular patch is also a very good idea in your plain kurtis or top for that you need to have some rajasthani printed sarees where you can uh, use that patches uh, you can use the block printed sarees patches also so just make that uh, a rectangular or a square one according to your bodies uh, just measure it and cut it out then you can decorate that uh, patch by adding a few uh, contrast color fabric strips also like you can see in front of you they had used a maroon color strips and uh, they had decorated the collar also with the same fabric so uh, here also they had used a uh, uh, lining strips the black one to decorate the patch so like this way you can use the same patch to decorate the collar and sleeves also so this is again a very beautiful idea if you can create this type of look if you can see in the market there are uh, many sarees where you can get a whole saree uh, from a plain fabric and uh, in the pallus they had given a, a strips like this so to use uh, that saree you can make a, a plain kurti from the plain fabrics of your saree and uh, with the pallus fabric you can make this type of overlapping uh, neckline a v shaped neckline and uh, you can give a loops also to decorate it further if you have a double colored half of saree uh, so you can use both the contrast colors to make the top and bottom part like this uh, to make the top you can decorate it with the patches uh, by using the pallus fabric uh, and uh, you can use the uh, strips uh, any strips or the lace work to decorate the neckline and the sleeves and uh, for the bottom part you can make a skirt uh, or a loose plazo pant if you have a plain sari with a embroidered uh, border then you can use that border to make this uh, type of neckline and uh, uh, decorate the sleeves like this and also the plain uh, fabric can be used to make the top and the plazo pant like this so hope you find this video a bit useful if you do then please hit the like button share this video with your friends and do not forget to subscribe my channel see you in the next video